I'm Fiona Mitchell and I'm the manager of this lovely day centre, Harlow Hill. My job is to make sure that when our members come through the door that we look after them with a lot of love and tender care and make sure that their day is as uplifting as it can be and we see the person, know the illness, we, we make sure that their disability doesn't stop them enjoying or doing anything. This started at the lovely award ceremony when we were at the table and Give a Dog a Bone was at the table behind us and of course when it came to the cheering, we were cheering really loud for us and then realised that they were actually in the same category mm -hmm. and just it was really interesting. I liked the, the fact that the, the event, you got to meet loads of different charities and we really bonded and realised that the dogs would be a great thing in our day centre. We had had animals in and I thought that our charity was wonderful what she'd done so it was that's why we thought let's meet up. Give a Dog a Bone is a registered charity. It's five and a half years old and we support the over 60s to afford a rescue pet companion and over and above that we have a community space project where we support the over 60s through loneliness and social isolation through animal companionship. Cooper and Max are two of our companionship dogs and we have a really special team of dogs at both of our community spaces in Glasgow and Troon. We hope to be expanding soon. But we have a team of dogs who are there to welcome people. For many people when they retire, they might have had a dog all their life but they really don't want the responsibility or they cannot have a dog any longer. So they can come to give a dog a bone for their doggy fix. And it was really special to hear that, you know, out of maybe 20 people there, all but two had had dogs in their lives, you know, so I think dogs are a great icebreaker and they bring back memories and, you know, they remind you of, of happy times and family times, etc. So I think it was quite a special thing to do.